Hello everybody, this is Gary of the Misinformed Brothers and welcome back to James Bond Jr. Now, if you remember from the previous episode, we got a password for the to get past the first level. So we're going to enter that now, which is 007. There we go. And press start. Yep. And here we go. Finally, a platforming level. Whoa. Nearly got hit by that. Take a grenade. There we go. Right down this ladder. Got Andrew's magic flute. Watch that. Whoa. Watch the snake. Watch the spikes. Right. Ah! Snake. Fuck. Grenade. There we go. Nothing a grenade can't handle. Now, up this ladder. What's going on? Fucking monkey with grenades! What the fuck? I got him. I got him. Right. What's across here? Ah! Another spear guy. Ah, missed the punch. <laughs> Take that, there we go. Right, more grenades. Watch the snakes. Fuck. I've got more. I got a gun. Now, for you guys, this is my first run through. I have died so many times, so I'm gonna look a bit professional here, but I, I assure you, this took me over an hour and 30 minutes to complete this one stage. And you'll see why, because it goes on forever. Now I've got my magic flute. Play my magic flute. There we go. Make the snakes dance for Andrew. And down we go. Watch this guy. Punch. Something satisfactory about that punch sound effect. Oh, fucking spikes coming out the ground. Hit him in the ass, but nothing James Bond Jr. can't handle. A bit of spike in the ass. Okay, grab the heart, duck, there we go, punch him, I could grenade these guys, I could even shoot them, but I'm finding it so much more satisfaction of punching them in their fucking giant faces, I mean, what, what, what are even these supposed to be, they're not, are they supposed to be members of scum, I don't know, but we'll continue on, dodge that snake, fuck whatever's up there, No, okay. Let's see what's up here. Fucking monkey with grenades. There we go. Extra life. That was worth the trip. Right. Up here. Uh, fucking. Uh. Got him. Got him. Not sure if that was even worth going up there. Yeah, there is another way to go. Fuck, watch that guy. Ah. Oh, more magic flute. Okay. Uh, uh, you fucking snake. Right. That was the only way to go. Now I've got to avoid the... Uh, i got to time the pounding ram. Pounding pillar and get through this perfectly. Ah, what am I doing? I know what I'm doing. I'm trying to make a sweet combat roll. Zah! There we go. Right. And that's the end of the first part. And now the second part. Hit him. And the snake. Excellent. Watch the spikes. Oh fuck. If he didn't have such a wide stance, this bit would be a lot easier. Why? Why such a wide stance? What are you hiding, James? Anyway. Entertainment there. I love I love secrets. What a nice little secret. Too bad it was just two grenades and not an extra life, but 
Mm, fucking monkeys and grenades. Who gave these monkeys grenades? It's very irresponsible. I've, I've, I really want to know what's over there. I hope it's an extra life. Nah. Got him. That. That wasn't worth one grenade. It cost me three grenades just to fucking get over there. Okay. A little secret shortcut that I found earlier. Mm. Fucking monkey. Damn dirty apes. And a magic flute. Get the magic flute out. Sweet combat roll for my jumping shoes and back out again. Right. Watch the pounding rams. Sweet roll. I don't need to do the roll. It's just satisfactory. <laughs> All right. Now I've got to avoid that spike and this spear guy. And I can't get him with a grenade. Mm. Now I can. There we go. Oh, ah, fucking monkey. You nearly had me, bastard. Right. Straight into number three. Magic editing done. Watch these fucking ramming spite, ramming uh, pillars. And avoid this fucker with the grenades. Right. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Shoot him. Yeah, I look like an expert right now, but that's because I've died so many fucking times in this area. More times in this area than any other. As these scum guys come out of the woodwork, and most of them are really difficult to kill because of where they're placed. And you'll see that in a moment. Some of them have got grenades, right, and you can't get them unless you're right at the edge. Basically, you've got to take a hit before you uh, before you can kill them. This guy, though, fuck him. He just throws a net. Lava. Ah, fuck. Never been too good at the floor as lava. Punch that guy. Press the wrong button. <laughs> Here we go. Well, that heart wasn't worth it. I lost two hearts because of that. Anyway, watch the spike. Kill that guy. Right. Down we go. Touch it. Perfect. Grenade that guy. Punch this guy. You take two hits. Why did you take two hits? Do you have reinforced shins? What the fuck? Right. Stages are so fucking long. There we go. I had a really difficult time getting through this area. I had to learn all that trick of having to be ducked and avoid the grenades. And especially this guy. He comes out of fucking nowhere. You couldn't even see him. I had to shoot him off screen. Which somehow worked. Most of the time it doesn't. And that guy, again, comes out of nowhere at the very end of a fucking platform. As you can see, I'm just done with this. Just gotta shoot them all. Can't watch that spike and the lava. Get my heart. There we go. Now there's an extra life on that collapsing platform. Got it. And now, I think this is the boss battle. Yep. Yeah. 
Doctor Derange. About time. Oh. Well, this is not that difficult. The whole stage. Ah, I've done it. Well. Well, that'll be that then. I hate you, James Bond Jr. You're always standing in the way of science. Next time will not stop me. Okay. Well, that's enough of that nonsense. Thank you very much, everybody, for watching again. And last time, I was I wished you all a good evening. I don't know why I did that. I'm very awkward when it comes to closing this off. But uh, thank you very much for watching. And uh, please stay tuned for another episode. Bye-bye now.